What is up guys, today we are inside of Bee Swarm Simulator, which is a game that some of you guys want me to return to, and I actually did not notice that M.A. was in the game until he actually just gave us, um, well, his festive B gave us the festive gift, so if you're watching this M.A., um, uh, thank you, because that helped. I, I mean, it didn't help by much, but it still is a little bit of honey, and a little bit goes a long way. Any, but anyways, though. Today I'm going to show you guys how to how to defeat the Commando B. Now keep in mind that I've done this a lot, so mine has a lot of health. So if you haven't done this before, he's going to have a lot less health, and he's not going to be as high of a, as a level. But first of all, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to go to this shop or the shop up there because I believe they also have an item that you need. Um, and you're going to want to get the scissors. Or the clippers if you haven't used them before now I've already used them for this so I don't need to grab them but basically once you have those equipped just run over to the clover field over here and then at right next to well not right next to but near brown bear there's this hole right here now if you haven't gone here before there will be vines here which you'll need the scissors to cut after you get after you cut them though you can get your um old pollen making thingy majiggy um if it's not as good as the clippers or scissors um but then basically you just hop from platform to platform and then onto this one but once you step in this room commando chick will spawn now as you can see mine has like 50,000 health again that's just because i used to um grind him a lot i don't do it as much anymore because i can get a lot better stuff in my opinion, um, in the time it takes to defeat him. Um, but it, at first, it, when you start the game, it's probably worth defeating him a few times. Now, you're going to need at, at least one B. I believe um, when you first encounter him, he only has 100 health, so it isn't too much, and you can get him down really fast. But basically, each time you kill him, his health is going to go up, and so is his level. So... <clears throat> It's going to get harder and harder. Now, I might actually be able to defeat Commando Chick this episode, because last time I defeated him, or tried to defeat him, um, I had terrible bees, and I only had, like, 25. Now I have 34, I believe. Um, so, this should go a lot smoother. I'm probably not going to beat him on camera, though, because I believe I've actually already made a video on me doing that. So, uh, I don't want to really do that again. But basically, <clears throat> I suggest that you get at least a little bit strong bees. Maybe like at least three damage um, per hit. So I suggest at least one of those. Um, if you want to do this fast, I'd suggest ten bees. But you can actually just do it with one, technically. It's just going to take a long time. So I'd, I'd get them to about level four, and then I'd start getting more bees again. <clears throat> because eventually, like I said, he's just going to keep getting harder and harder. So eventually it's going to take forever again. Kind of like how it's taking me a bit of time right now, even though um I have strong bees. But again, I will get him down pretty fast because I've improved my bees from the last time I fought him. So basically, you just keep running around the room and jumping over him. That's really the best way to not get hit. But basically, what he'll do is he'll run around the room for a bit, and then just like that, he'll turn into an egg so that your attacks only do one damage most of the time. Sometimes I believe they can do two or three, but most of the time he'll only do one. It also launches a grenade um, when he goes into his shell, so you gotta be careful for that, because you don't want to die from that. So basically, just keep running around the room, and he'll not really be able to hit you while walking to you, unless you accidentally walk into him, which happens sometimes. But as you can see, he throws the grenades that go off, like you'd expect. You have a little bit of time to get away from them, though, so they shouldn't hit you all that often. But, uh, yeah, it's basically how to take down, um, Commando Chick inside of B Swarm Simulator. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you guys are new to the channel, or you want some more Roblox B Swarm Simulator, and everybody, peace out.